Now, the other thing about tax season is that taxes should not be a surprise to you. I mean, if you've been working with your accountant throughout the year, when you get to tax season, you shouldn't be surprised by what you see. I mean, for the most part, I mean, if you're running a business, you're going to have to pay estimated taxes and, you know, if you're going to get make a profit. So what you should have been doing is looking throughout the year and saying, hey, based on what has happened in actual results, based on what we project to happen for the rest of the year, this is about how much profit we expect. So you can kind of plan ahead of time and you can either start to set the money aside or you can start to make the payments in advance. Because if you aren't looking ahead like that, what ends up happening is you get to the end of the year and you're like, well, I hope I have a tax refund. And if you end up having to pay, you don't have the money, which means if you don't have the money about a 15, the IRS is going to start charging you interest and you might have to pay penalties. And it's just not a situation you want to be in. So what you want to do is start working with your accountant and start thinking future focus, like looking ahead so that you're planning in advance. So when you get your taxes done, it's like, oh, OK, yeah, I already had the money set aside for that. Or, hey, I expected that to be the result or I relatively expected that to be the result and I'm prepared for whatever the outcome is.